Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving into the exciting world of coin collecting, specifically focusing on the top 10 most valuable silver Kennedy half dollars in today's market. First up uncover the value of a very special coin the US silver Kennedy half dollar 1972, large date with a D mint mark, in extra fine condition. This particular Kennedy half dollar is a true gem for collectors. Minted in 1972 at the Denver Mint, it holds both historical significance and intrinsic value. Let's delve into why it's highly sought after and how much it's worth in today's collector's market. The 1972 Kennedy half dollar is a significant piece of American history. It was struck during a time of political and social turbulence, marking the latter years of the Vietnam War and the Nixon administration. The large date variety of this coin distinguishes it from others minted that year adding to its rarity and appeal. Now, let's talk about condition. The extra fine grade indicates that the coin has minimal wear, with most of the original details still visible. This is crucial for determining its value. In today's collector's market, the value of the US Silver Kennedy Half Dollar 1972 large date with a D mint mark, in extra fine condition, can vary based on several factors these include its rarity, demand, and overall condition. So, how much is it worth? Well, as of today, the coin can fetch anywhere from two hundred thousands of dollars in the collector's market, depending on its specific attributes and the current demand. However, it's essential to remember that prices can fluctuate over time. For serious collectors, owning a piece of history like this Kennedy half dollar is not just about its monetary value but also about the story it tells and the connection to the past. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting, Exploring the world of numismatics can be both fascinating and rewarding. Each coin has its own unique story to tell, waiting to be discovered by those who appreciate the beauty and history behind it. That wraps up our exploration of the US Silver Kennedy Half Dollar 1972, large date with a D mint mark, in extra fine condition. Stay tuned for more insights into the captivating world of coin collecting. Next up, the US Silver Kennedy Half Dollar 1983 large date with a D mint mark in extra fine condition. The 1983 Silver Kennedy Half Dollar is a beloved piece of American numismatic history. Struck in 90% silver, this coin features the iconic portrait of President John F. Kennedy on the obverse and the presidential seal on the reverse. But what makes the 1983 large date with a D mint mark so special? Well, it's all about rarity and condition. While millions of Kennedy half dollars were minted in 1983, the large date variety with the Denver mint mark is relatively scarce, adding to its appeal among collectors. Now, let's talk about condition. Numismatic grading standards play a crucial role in determining the value of a coin. The extra fine condition indicates that this coin has minimal wear, with only slight traces visible on its surfaces. So what's the value of this prized coin in today's collector market? Well, it can vary depending on factors such as rarity, demand, and overall condition. As of our latest research, the US Silver Kennedy Half Dollar 1983 large date with a D mint mark in extra fine condition can command a significant premium. In today's collector market, you can expect to pay anywhere from $300,000 of dollars for this coin in extra fine condition. However, it's essential to do your research and consult with reputable dealers to ensure you're getting a fair price. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting your numismatic journey, the US Silver Kennedy Half Dollar 1983 large date with a D mint mark in extra fine condition is a timeless piece of American history worth adding to your collection. Next up today, we're diving into the intriguing world of the 1988 US Silver Kennedy Half Dollar with a large date and a P mint mark. The 1988 Silver Kennedy Half Dollar holds a special place in the hearts of collectors Due to its rarity and historical significance, minted during a time of transition, this coin marks a pivotal moment in numismatic history. But what makes this particular coin stand out? Well, it's all in the details. The large date and the presence of the P-Mint mark indicate that this coin was minted at the Philadelphia Mint, adding to its allure and desirability among collectors. Now, let's talk value. In today's collector market, a 1988 US Silver Kennedy half dollar in extra fine condition can fetch a pretty penny. 
According to recent data, a 1988 Silver Kennedy half dollar in extra fine condition with a large date and a P mint mark can command anywhere from 400 thousands of dollars depending on its overall condition and market demand. Of course, as with any collectible, factors such as rarity, condition, and market trends can influence the value of this coin. So, if you're lucky enough to come across one of these beauties in your collection, be sure to take good care of it. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, the 1988 US Silver Kennedy half dollar with a large date and a P mint mark is a must-have addition to any numismatic portfolio. Its unique features and historical significance make it a prized treasure for generations to come. Next up explore the fascinating story and value of the 1985 Kennedy half dollar with a large date and D mint mark in uncirculated condition. The 1985 Kennedy half dollar holds a special place in the hearts of collectors due to its unique characteristics and historical significance. Let's delve into why this particular coin is highly sought after and how much it's worth in today's collecting market. First off, what sets the 1985 Kennedy half dollar apart is its large date, distinguishing it from other years. Minted at the Denver Mint, the D Mint mark signifies its origin, adding to its collectability. Now, Let's talk about condition. Uncirculated coins, like the one we have here, are prized for their pristine state, free from wear and tear commonly found on circulated coins. This adds to their rarity and desirability among collectors. Inspecting the coin closely, you'll notice its sharp strike, lustrous surfaces, and intricate details, all characteristics of an uncirculated specimen. So, what's the value of this remarkable coin in today's collecting market? According to recent data from Collecta, a leading online platform for coin enthusiasts, the 1985 Kennedy half dollar in uncirculated condition with a large date and D mint mark commands a premium price. Drum roll, please. In today's market, you can expect to pay anywhere from $200,456 for this stunning coin, depending on its overall condition and any additional factors such as toning or special packaging. But remember, the value of coins can fluctuate based on market demand, so it's always a good idea to stay informed and consult with reputable dealers or experts before making any purchases. And there you have it, folks. The story and value of the 1985 Kennedy half dollar with a large date and D mint mark in uncirculated condition. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, this coin is sure to be a prized addition to any collection. Next up exploring the value of a particular gem, the 1973 US Silver Kennedy half dollar with the large date and without a mint mark. Before we delve into its worth in today's collector market, let's take a quick trip down memory lane. The 1973 Kennedy half dollar is a unique piece of American coinage history. Struck in 40% silver, it pays homage to the late President John F. Kennedy, who tragically left us too soon. But what sets this coin apart is its large date variety and the absence of a mint mark. While the Philadelphia Mint typically placed P mint mark on coins minted there, the 1973 edition without a mint mark is a rarity. Now, let's talk value. In uncirculated condition, this coin is a prized possession for collectors. Its rarity and historical significance contribute to its allure. In today's collector market, the 1973 US Silver Kennedy half dollar with the large date and without a mint mark commands a premium. Prices can vary depending on factors such as condition, rarity, and demand. So how much is it worth? Well, collectors, brace yourselves. In uncirculated condition, this coin can fetch anywhere from $100,000 of dollars or more depending on its quality and other market factors. But remember, folks, the value of collectible coins can fluctuate over time. It's essential to stay informed and consult with experts before buying or selling. Whether you're a seasoned collector or a newcomer to the hobby, the allure of coins like the 1973 US Silver Kennedy half dollar reminds us of the rich history and artistry encapsulated in each piece. And there you have it, collectors. The 1973 US Silver Kennedy half dollar a treasure worth cherishing in any numismatist's collection. Next up explore the significance and market value of the 1776 to 1976 Bicentennial Kennedy half dollar, specifically the large date without mint mark in uncirculated condition. The Bicentennial Kennedy half dollar holds a special place in American history and coin collecting. 
issued in 1976 to commemorate the 200th anniversary of the United States Declaration of Independence, this coin features a stunning design honoring President John F. Kennedy. Designed by Gilroy Roberts and Frank Gasparro, the obverse of the coin showcases a profile of President Kennedy, while the reverse features the Independence Hall in Philadelphia with the Liberty Bell superimposed in front of it. The coin's design symbolizes the spirit of freedom and democracy. Now, let's talk about the specific variety we're focusing on today, the large date without mint mark. Minted at the Philadelphia Mint, this particular version of the Bicentennial Kennedy Half Dollar is highly sought after by collectors due to its rarity and unique characteristics. Unlike its counterparts minted at the Denver and San Francisco Mints, which bear a small D or S mint mark, the Philadelphia Mint version does not have a mint mark, making it distinctive and valuable to collectors. In uncirculated condition, the 1776 to 1976 Bicentennial Kennedy half-dollar large date without mint mark can fetch a handsome sum in today's collector market. The value of this coin can vary depending on factors such as its condition, rarity, and demand. According to recent market trends and price guides, an uncirculated 1776 to 1976 Bicentennial Kennedy half-dollar large date without mint mark can range in value from 300 thousands of dollars or more depending on its condition and other factors. It's important for collectors to carefully assess the condition of the coin, looking for signs of wear, scratches or damage, as these factors can significantly impact its value. Additionally, rarity plays a crucial role in determining the coin's worth. For serious collectors, obtaining a Bicentennial Kennedy half-dollar large date without mint mark in uncirculated condition can be a thrilling pursuit, adding a unique and historical piece to their collection. So, whether you're a seasoned collector or a novice enthusiast, the 1776 to 1976 Bicentennial Kennedy half-dollar large date without mint mark is a captivating piece of American history and numismatic treasure worth exploring. Next up, explore the value of a rare gem in the coin collecting community, the 1977 US Silver Kennedy half dollar with a large date and without a mint mark. The 1977 Silver Kennedy half dollar is already a highly sought after coin, but what sets this particular version apart is its large date and the absence of a mint mark. Now, let's talk about its value. In today's collecting market, the 1977 Silver Kennedy half dollar in uncirculated condition, with a large date and no mint mark, commands quite a premium. While the value can vary based on factors like condition and market demand, collectors are willing to pay a significant sum to add this rarity to their collections. What makes this coin so special? Well, it's all about rarity and historical significance. The absence of a mint mark indicates that it was minted at the Philadelphia Mint, adding to its appeal among collectors. Plus, the large date variety adds another layer of uniqueness, making it a must-have for serious collectors. So, how much is this coin worth in today's market? While prices can fluctuate, a 1977 Silver Kennedy half-dollar in uncirculated condition, with a large date and no mint mark, can fetch anywhere from $89,000 or more, depending on its condition and other factors. It's definitely one of those coins that collectors keep an eye out for. The combination of its rarity and historical significance makes it a prized addition to any collection. I've seen these coins sell for a pretty penny at auctions and coin shows. Serious collectors are always on the lookout for that next great find, and the 1977 Silver Kennedy half dollar fits the bill perfectly. There you have it, folks. The 1977 US Silver Kennedy half dollar with a large date and without a mint mark, a true treasure in the world of coin collecting. Whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, keep your eyes peeled for this elusive beauty. Who knows? You might just strike numismatic gold. Next up, the 1974 Silver Kennedy half dollar with a large date and no mint mark. So what makes this coin so unique and what's its value in today's collector's market? Let's find out. First off, let's talk about the history behind this iconic coin. The Kennedy half dollar was first minted in 1964, just months after the tragic assassination of President John F. Kennedy. It was a way for the nation to honor his memory, and these coins quickly became highly sought after by collectors. Now, the 1974 Silver Kennedy half dollar is particularly intriguing because of its large date and the absence of a mint mark. 
Minted in Philadelphia, these coins were part of a limited run, making them even more valuable to collectors. But what exactly is the value of this coin in today's collector's market? Well, it depends on a few factors such as its condition, rarity, and demand. In uncirculated condition, meaning it's never been used as currency and is in pristine condition, the 1974 Silver Kennedy half dollar can fetch a pretty penny. As of today, in the collector's market, an uncirculated 1974 Silver Kennedy half dollar with a large date and no mint mark can range in value from around 200 thousands of dollars or more, depending on its specific attributes and the overall condition. Of course, it's always important to have your coins appraised by a professional to get an accurate valuation. And remember, the value of coins can fluctuate over time, so it's essential to stay informed about market trends. And there you have it, folks. The 1974 Silver Kennedy half dollar with a large date and no mint mark is not only a piece of American history, but also a valuable addition to any coin collection. Next up, the captivating world of the 1971 large date Kennedy half dollar without a mint mark. This coin, often overshadowed by its counterparts, holds a special place in the hearts of collectors for its scarcity and historical significance. So, let's explore its journey and current value in today's market. Firstly, let's unravel the backstory of this elusive coin. Struck in 1971, this Kennedy half dollar bears a large date on its obverse distinguishing it from the regular issues of the year. What sets it apart even further is the absence of a mint mark, making it one of the rarest varieties among Kennedy half dollars. Due to a production error or perhaps a unique circumstance at the mint, a small number of these coins were minted without the usual mint mark, creating a frenzy among collectors eager to add this gem to their collections. Now, Let's get down to the nitty-gritty the value of this remarkable coin in today's collector's market. In uncirculated condition, the 1971 large date Kennedy half dollar without a mint mark commands a significant premium. As of our latest research, in the current collector's market, the value of this coin ranges from approximately $87,000 or even higher, depending on its condition and the demand at the time of sale. Keep in mind, Collectors, that the value of rare coins like this one can fluctuate based on various factors such as market demand, condition, and historical significance. Therefore, it's always wise to stay informed and consult with reputable experts before making any transactions. And there you have it, folks, the fascinating tale and current value of the 1971 large date Kennedy half dollar without a mint mark. Remember, whether you're a seasoned collector or just starting out, each coin tells a unique story, waiting to be discovered. Next up, the US Silver Kennedy Half Dollar 1984 Large Date with P-Era Mint Mark. Let's delve into the fascinating story and value of this rare coin in today's collector's market. The Kennedy Half Dollar, introduced in 1964 following the tragic assassination of President John F. Kennedy holds a special place in American coinage, minted in 90% silver until 1970 it symbolizes a pivotal moment in U.S. history. However, it's the variations and errors that truly captivate collectors. In 1984, a production mishap resulted in some Kennedy half dollars bearing a large date variety and an unexpected P-mint mark, representing the Philadelphia Mint. This error occurred due to a mix-up in the minting process, making these coins highly sought after by collectors. Finding a U.S. Silver Kennedy half dollar 1984 large date with P-era mint mark in uncirculated condition is like discovering a hidden treasure. These coins, untouched by circulation, retain their original luster and detail, making them even more desirable among collectors. Now, let's talk about the value. In today's collector's market, the U.S. Silver Kennedy half dollar 1984 large date with P-era mint mark in uncirculated condition commands a significant premium. Depending on factors such as rarity, condition, and demand, its value can range 900 thousands of dollars. The US Silver Kennedy half dollar 1984 large date with P-era mint mark is a prime example of a modern numismatic rarity. Its combination of historical significance, production error, and uncirculated condition makes it a must-have for serious collectors. As the years go by, its value is likely to appreciate further, making it a wise investment choice. And there you have it, 
Folks, the captivating tale and value of the U.S. Silver Kennedy Half Dollar 1984 Large Date with P. Era Mint Mark in uncirculated condition. Remember, the world of coin collecting is filled with hidden gems waiting to be discovered. Until next time, happy collecting.